Hello, everybody. Welcome to, uh, what the hell? Oh, hang on. Let me, uh, do a little something and try this again. Ah, much better. Anyways, hello, everybody. Welcome to a new LP by me, WizWar100. What is the game? Well, it's a game I mentioned before on, uh, Thingamabob, a vlog. This is a story about Baby Mario and Yoshi. A stork hurries across the dusty pre-dawn sky. In his bill, he supports a pair of twins. Suddenly, a shadow appears in a gap between the clouds and races towards the stork with a blinding speed. Or wolf blinding speed. Screech! The babies are mine! Wow! Snatching only one baby, the creature vanishes. And the stork spins in eternity into the darkness from whence it came. The second baby falls undetected towards the open sea. Oh no! Meanwhile, here is Yoshi's Island, home to all Yoshis. It's a lovely day, and Yoshi is taking a walk. Huh? Sudden, suddenly, a baby drops in onto his back. The baby seems to be fine. This is very fortunate. What? Some, what? Something else fell with the baby. Let's take a peek. It looks like a map. Maybe the stork was using it. And being the good natured, but Yoshi can't figure it out. But being good natured characters, Yoshi's gonna help. Yoshi decides to talk to his friends. Ah! Kami, the evil Mac Magic Koopa and kidnapper of the baby, quickly dispatches his toadies. When he discovers that he missed the other baby. I always thought Kami was a... Was a lady. Like a lady witch. Yoshi heads leisurely back to the other Yoshis. Unaware of the danger at hand. Kami's forces are actively searching the island. Or is it comics? Will these two children ever reach their parents safely? Ah yes, Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island, or just commonly referred to as Yoshi's Island because everyone forgets about the Super Mario World. So, the reason I'm playing this game is because, well, I have the Yoshi new, Yoshi's New Island game on 3DS, and that game kind of sucked, and it made me want to go play the original game. So let's start with file one. Du -du 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 -du. I, I really do love this game. Oh, hmm. No, you son of a bitch. Sorry about that. Let me try that again. Yeah, I... That file did not look like it was uh, used at all. So I'll quickly erase that. All oh, right, that that's that's why. Oh, hmm. Oh, whatever. Let's just try that again. Start a new game. And here in the land of the Yoshi's, all the Yoshi's gathered around Baby Mario, wondering what to do. 
This paradise is Yoshi's Island, where all the Yoshis live. They are all in an, up in an uproar over the baby that fell from the sky. Yoshi jumps up hysterically and says, I got a plan. Wait, the baby seems to know where he wants to go. The bond between the twins inform each of them where the other one is. The Yoshis decide to carry the baby to his destination via a re relay system. Now begins a new adventure for the Yoshis and baby, Mario. Even though they're all here, what kind of relay system is this? So they all know a different shortcut to get to the next location? I don't get it either, but it makes for a pretty good game. Welcome to Yoshi's Island. If Baby Mario falls off Yoshi's back, the countdown timer will begin. When it reaches zero, Comics Toads will, co will kidnap Baby Mario. The more stars you collect, the safer you are. The countdown timer will slowly count back up to ten. Complete a stage by passing Baby Mario to the next Yoshi. Now unlike what uh, Ermi or Urkoko says, this game is, is really good. Almost great. And for not seeing what it is, it's a shame. Let's see. I'd say it's a lot better than... Actually, it's hard to say if it's a lot better than Super Mario World. By holding blah 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 blah, these are just tutorial stuff, so I'm not gonna bother with, with it too much. I don't think there are any red coins here, so... That's why I'm kinda stopping a little bit by bit. In fact, this is, the, this is not even a level. This is only exclusive to, um... When you start a new game. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. So let's start World 1. I want to go for the 100% thing too, so... 1-1. One one. Make eggs! Throw eggs! Somehow that sounded kind of weird. Alright, what does he have to say? These info boxes. Making eggs. Rub it into me, then shit it out your ass. Got it. Ah, this... This game is... Uh, this game is so much fun and it's so good. Yeah, gather five for a one-up. They add to your total point. They also add the gold ring roulette. Let's see. It just controls so much better. It's just you know, everything is just better than the new Yoshi's uh, Island, which was crap. I need to stop reading those things. They they don't really. If you've played a lot like I have, and have lots of experience with it, you really don't need need to um. You really shouldn't need to read it. Also, I don't know what's so. Also, I don't know what's so weird about the uh, the uh, egg system, the egg throwing system. I thought it worked just fine. Maybe it's just me being. Uh, maybe it's just me. Fuck that. Fuck. God damn it. What was I trying to say? Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with the egg system. Someone said like this egg system was very weird and it didn't work that great. I'd completely disagree. I think it works perfectly fine. But anyway, I was saying, I'm not, I'm not actually sure which one I'd say I like better. This, or, uh, or Super Mario World 2, or Super Mario World 1. Because I like both of them. By the way, this flower gives stars if you shoot things into it. But I can definitely say with, with certainty that, uh, I definitely do like this over Super, or... Yoshi's New Island, which was just... It was just crap. It didn't control that great. It was also very... It was surprisingly, like... Like, difficult in the sense that it's just kind of unfair. Right, you gotta press the A button to, uh, think of a bomb. I'd say I'm... Very, very, quite relatively good at this game. Not to brag, of course. Because if I was, I'd be able to do the special bonus stage. I, I, I managed to finish them, but I'm... I never got 100% in those, because those are... Oh boy, those 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 are really, real tough. You'll, you'll see when we get to play them. Everything else in this game, pretty normal. Actually, <coughs> there is one world that I uh, didn't get 100% in, like, to unlock the bonus stage, and that was the last world, because of this... One particular area that's really tricky, and if you'll notice, some of the coins are slightly tinted red, like those two. Ah, the subtleties. The subtleties of this game. This one's also red, too. The subtleties of this game. It's, it's really cool, and the graphics look great. Unlike in Yoshi's uh, New Island, there is no such thing as subtlety. In fact, 
the requirement to get everything in the level is really just... It's actually kind of, like, really punishing. And I'm talking about the first few worlds. So there's something wrong with that. Also, I, uh... I know Zero Master was also Let's Playing this. I've only seen him play, like, a much, much later level, but... Kind of had to stop watching, because it was just like... He made the, the easiest part, like, so much difficult for some reason. We can go down here, which is just primarily for us to get enemies at twice the rate. So nothing really, really useful there. But yeah, you'll, you'll see me... Ch you'll, you'll hear me talk about, oh, well, Yoshi's Island 2 is... Or Yoshi Island 1 is great. Because it is. You know, I still play it and I still enjoy it. It's just great. Is it perfect? I wouldn't... Well, no game is perfect, but I would definitely, definitely highly recommend this game. I mean, I still own this game. Forgot if it was my cousin's or if it was actually, like... Like, I actually bought it. Either way, great game. Alright, that noise right there signified that we got all 20 red coins. Blah, 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 blah. I need to get some stars, though. I think this will give us some stars. Yeah, but there's a lot of stuff in Yoshi's New Line that's kind of missing. And I'm, I'm, I know I'm only saying, like, uh... I'm only saying this for, like, the first few levels, but it's just, like... It's enough to bother me. Now, if you get those flowers, you get a bonus... You get a bonus challenge. In Yoshi's New Island, you just get coins for it. I don't know what they do yet, so I'm not exactly sure. Got it 100 like Wizwar 100. Man, that took a while for the first level. Scratch and match. 1-up chance. Scratch three bosses and cover Mario to gain 1-up. Scratch on. 3 totally equals nothing, 1 Mario equals that. Uh, yada 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 yada. Alright. Man, eat a... Eat a crock of crap. Usually there's something in the middle. Anyways, I, I don't really like this mini game. Is it a... Oh yeah, we got two one-ups. That's pretty cool. Not that I'll really need it, except for those special levels. Alright, move on to the next Yoshi. I think we can do one more level. Oh, hang on a second. There we go. Yeah, there's a minigame battle you can access if you uh, press a certain button combination. Which, if you're curious, then go ask about it, because otherwise I won't let you know about it. Watermelon spinning contest. Grab a watermelon and shoot him. This is basically uh, pretty much a first... Well, not a first-person shooter. It's, uh, it's a shooter, all right. I thought it showed off. Uh, you also do get some rewards for it, too. Ow! Let's see, and as you saw from the, uh, ah, items. Yes, that's another thing. You can actually get items in this game. Uh, let's see, okay, you can do speed, sp uh, seed spit and throw. And the thingamabob. And you can get items cheaply that way, but, hey, it lets you do that and you have to know the secret to it. 1-2, watch out below. If you press the start button, you'll get to see your score, you get to see all the stuff, and then you can see the items on the bottom. Which, um... You get to use, and they and they help, and they do help you because some will give you stars, some will give you watermelon, some will just give you some special abilities. Uh, not needed, but it is very cool. Oh, and here we got the chain chomps who blocked my egg. I got egg blocked. Oh, <laughs> that was close. I wouldn't say uh, Yoshi's Island is an easy game. I wouldn't. I would definitely not call it a real difficult game, but it's generous and nice enough. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, the continue ring. What do you want here? You remember presenting the Mega Name? Jeez, I just played through the first level. You don't need to tell me that. Yeah, those things will. Those uh, pipes will always have some sort of enemy for you to uh, grab. 
Yeah, that's another. That's a neat thing. If you can, if you can uh, get Yoshi to grab the egg, what the egg that you fired, you can actually reuse it again. Which is a uh, which is really cool. And the egg colors determine like what effects they'll do. Green eggs do nothing. Yellow eggs will cause coins to appear, which isn't which isn't much, but still is a neat thing. And the um, I believe the red eggs give you stars and not red coins. Otherwise, it'd be real. It'd be way too easy to get a uh, get the red coins. We gotta go back. Yeah, if you hold the R button when you're aiming, you just lock where you're shooting. I personally don't really need to use it, but it is very, very helpful and very, very nice. Ah, yes, those are not the middle rings, those are the checkpoint rings, so... Unlike, say, Donkey Kong Country, where you only had one continued barrel. Use special item thing. I'll have to play more of Yoshi's New Island to see if, uh... You actually do get items, and, uh, and that I'm not just, you know complaining about an aspect that I just haven't seen yet. I'll just have to try more, but it just doesn't control that well. If you've played this game, Yoshi's Island, and uh, played it very fondly, you can... you'll know the subtleties. Yeah, so I'll get to transform into items too, which is in Yoshi's New Island. I just haven't gotten into it yet. Get to the chopper! Ah, get to the chopper! Ah, Yoshi's the chopper! Yeah, you also, it's also for a limited amount of time, too, because I guess the transformation magic just doesn't last that long. Now oh, get to the chopper! Get to the checkpoint! Ah, there we go. But of course, being that I'm going to be 100%ing the game, I'm gonna have to actually track back a little bit. So I apologize for that. And as per usual, I'll edit stuff if, uh... If, you know, it drags on. You know, I always not waste your guys' time too much. Ah, I probably missed something there. I'll, you know what, I'll just backtrack there. So, you know, the same thing I did in, uh, Donkey Kong Country, uh, uh, 3. Wow, looks like I definitely missed a coin there somewhere. Yep, I missed one red coin somewhere. Yeah, oh yeah, you can also stop where the where the spinner lands a little bit, or at least affect it, unlike in uh, Yoshi's New Island, which you can't really. 99, don't worry. So, we're back to where uh, I originally was, but anyways, that'll be the end, end for this video. Two levels again. Next time, we'll get on to hopefully finishing this world in Yoshi's Island. So, I'm WizWorld100, you're the viewers, and I'm the Let's Player. So, see ya, and check out my review channel!